Millicent Akoth and her sister-in-law, Lucia Kinyi, have come to this clinic to vaccinate their children against malaria. It is spread by mosquitoes and one of the three deadliest diseases for under five-year-olds in Kenya. Millicent has brought her first child, Humphrey. I chose to bring my son to get vaccinated because I saw Lucy bring her children. After bringing her youngest child here, she has never had any issues with malaria, and so I brought my child to get vaccinated to be malaria-free. Kenya is one of three countries which started trials of a revolutionary vaccine, known as RTSS, in 2019. It was developed over three decades, and last year, the World Health Organization approved it for use. Before, children with malaria filled paediatric wards in Western Kenya. Not anymore. Cases have dropped by 38% compared to 2017. Uh, since we started administering the malaria vaccine in 2019, September, we have seen a reduction on the cases of malaria. And even the children who get malaria, they, it's not severe. And the number of deaths out of malaria has also gone down. Lucy says the family's income stretches a lot further because the children fall less ill. The money that we used to use to take the children to hospital is now being used to buy the children food to eat. I buy milk for them to drink. The children are now happy, and we're all happy here at home. Kenya records 3.5 million cases of malaria per year and over 10,000 deaths. Dr. Simon Karayuki heads the malaria section in the Center for Global Health Research in nearby Kisumu. He explains the wide benefits of the drop in infections. If you reduce that by 40%, then you can see the impact it will have, first of all, in the families. They will not have to spend money going to the health facilities. They will not have to spend money buying drugs. They will not have to spend money attending funerals and uh, taking care of diseased people children, unfortunately, and also on the healthcare system. The number of children reaching the hospital is reduced. More than 100,000 children in Western Kenya have received the new jabs by now. It is the only vaccine that has proven effective in reducing malaria in young children, giving thousands hope of a better life.